So in this example, ladies and gentlemen, if you guys remember for basically what we were talking about is if you go from the side length to the hypotenuse, you multiply by the square root of 2, correct? So therefore, if I'm asking you for like what is x and y, for instance, or, well, to go from the, the hypotenuse to the denominator, then I'll have to divide by square root of 2. Well, I'm going to solve y here real quick because I have a little bit more room space over here. So it's 10 divided by square root of 2. Now, one process you're going to get very, very familiar with very, very quickly is rationalizing the denominator. We don't usually regard this as simplified form. So rather than leaving that in our, our square root in our denominator, we rationalize the denominator. So we multiply by the square root of 2 over square root of 2. So 10 square root of 2 is going to leave us 10 square root of 2. And then square root of 2 times square root of 2 is going to leave us with 2. Well, make sure also you simplify this. 5 square root of 2, right? Then, if that's 5 square root of 2, then this also has to be 5 square root of 2, because they're exactly the same. Is everybody cool with that? All right, let's just do one more.